Uh, so, ladies and gentlemen, uh, welcome again. Uh, in this video, uh, we are going to learn how we can copy or move a worksheet in Microsoft Excel. I have a list of procedures we can follow, but without wasting time, I'm going to take you into Microsoft Excel software so that I can show you step by step how this can be achieved. So to start with, I'll go ahead to Windows uh, uh, Windows Start uh, option, then I click Start, then I will look for Microsoft Excel. Go ahead and open it. After opening Microsoft Excel, uh, open a blank workbook. Now that you have a blank workbook, I want you to name this uh, book uh, with the name of your choice. So in this case, I'm going to name it and, and save it in uh, my document library uh, with the name uh, book one uh, sample. Go ahead and save the book. After that, I'm going uh, I'll go ahead and uh, I'll close that, and then I open another one, and then I will give it a different name. I will give it a different name, and that is going to be uh, still under document library. I'm going to give it, uh, say, uh, uh, book two uh, sample two, sample two two. Then I go ahead and save it also. So after that, now I'm going to, you, by default, you see I have uh, this uh, sheet, uh, one which is the automatic. So I can add the new sheet so there can be two uh, by right clicking and then selecting insert. And then I go ahead and insert a sheet. So I have two sheets, sheet one and sheet two. Now I want to see how I can uh, move this sheet from one place to another. Maybe I can first add a new sheet so that they become three. So I now have uh, these three sheets, one, two, and three. So to move this sheet three to sheet one, I right click and then I get a list of options. And one of them, which is the fourth option, is move or copy. So in this case, I'm going to select move. Now on this, I'm going to move to select this uh, key. I'm going to move this sheet to the book a uh, one sample two. This is the existing, the w current worksheet, the, the current book I'm working on. So I'm going to move this to a uh, sheet uh, one. Then from there, uh, you can say create a copy and then press OK. So when you see that, uh, I mean after doing that, you realize that now uh, after sheet one, I've created a copy of sheet three. So I have sheet three, but then I have a copy of this. What about if I want to copy uh, sheet two? Right click on it, select move or copy. Then from there, uh, uh, can move it to sheet one and then make a copy of it. Select OK, and then you see sheet two has been copied into a new copy. So copying and moving is different. Uh, this is because when you copy a sheet, it re remains with an uh, original and then you get a copy of it. Whereas when you move a sheet, it is the same way, it's the same as like cutting a sheet from where it was originally to another location. So let us see how this one is done. For example, I want to uh, move uh, this sheet too. So I go ahead and right click on that. I select move. And now, in this case, I will not check this. I will not check this box. And I'm just going to move it to sheet one. Then I press OK. Now, you can see I've moved the sheet two uh, where it has been. Now I've changed the location. It is now on the side of sheet one. So that's how we can copy and move uh, different sheets within the same workbook. What about if I want to move a sheet here to a different workbook in my in Microsoft Excel. So I'm going to move a sheet to a copy to. So now what I'm going to do, I will select that, right click and select move. Then from there, you see this option where they are saying to book. You click here and select a new book. Now in this new book, uh, 
uh, Microsoft Excel will open for me a new book automatic. So you can create a copy uh, once the sheet has been transferred. Click, uh, go ahead and click OK. Now a new book will be open, which is book two, and then you can see uh, sheet one, I mean sheet two has been created. What about if I want to move this to a new book? Go ahead, select, you want to move this to a new book, and create a copy, press OK, and then a new book, which is book three, will be created, and then the sheet will be copied. What about if I want to take this sheet to one of the existing books in my Excel? So far I have book, book one, sample 22, I have book two, sample, I mean I have book two and I have book three. But before that, I want to rename this sheet and give it a name, say, password. After that, now I want to move this sheet. Remember this is book three. This is in book three. I want to move this from this book to a new book, I mean to a book which is called book one sample 22. So I'll go ahead and select that. Then from there, they're asking me, do, do you want the, the sheet to be uh, pressed uh, before the sheet or at the end of the sheet? So in this case, I'm going to put it at the end of the sheet and then I don't want a copy. I just want to move that. Then go ahead and press OK. Now you can see when we open or when a book one sample 22 is open, you will see the new sheet that have been moved from the other book to, uh, to this book and you can see even the name password so for you to verify and confirm. So otherwise, that's how you can play around with this. And remember, this is very important because uh, when you are working with Microsoft Excel, I know you can uh, have many books and you can have many worksheets. So sometimes you realize it is very important to share or to transfer different sheets so that uh, they can uh, work hand in hand or they can, uh, you know, uh, instead of like uh, struggling to retype the information again, you can move the exact sheet, the whole sheet with all the information uh, to a, a certain book within uh, your Excel software and then uh, that one makes your life easy. Otherwise, uh, I appreciate you for coming and paying attention to this video. Uh, more videos are coming. I want to say that uh, you are good uh, guys and uh, we love you f so much for uh, your support uh, you can also share and invite your friends to subscribe to our channel and also register with our website and you can also follow us on our Facebook page Tabby Talks and then everything gonna be okay otherwise thank you let's catch up in the next video